Describing a photo is not an easy thing to do in English. I think this video is going to be so helpful. This question type is so important because it contributes heavily to your production sub-score. Five key points to describe a picture question type. 1. 60 to 90 seconds to complete the answer. 2. Need to speak for at least 30 seconds or half a minute. 3. You will have 20 seconds to prepare your answer. 4. You can see the photo or picture while speaking. 5. You cannot re-record your answer. It is one time only. How you are scored. 1. Content. How well you describe a photo or picture. 2. Grammar and vocabulary. The level of variety of your grammatical structure and vocabulary. 3. Fluency. How long you can speak about the photo or picture. 4. Pronunciation. How clearly you can speak or talk. 8 tips and tricks. Tip number 1. Prepare before you start speaking. Tip number 2. Avoid fillers words. For example, uh, um and so on. Tip number 3. Do not label a picture. Tip number 4. Learn introductory statements. You can use predefined statements. For instance, this is a picture of. This photo shows. In this image there is, there are. This is a stunning photograph of. In this photo I can see. Tip number 5. What is where? Three ways to do this. 1. Left to right, a right to left. 2. Top to bottom, a bottom to top. 3. Far to near, a near to far. Tip number 6. What is in the image and where is it positioned? 1. In the background. 2. In the foreground. 3. In front of. 4. Directly opposite. 5. Exactly in the middle of. 6. Roughly in the middle of. 7. In close proximity to. 8. Just above. 9. Parallel to. Tip number 7. Who is doing what? Present continuous, action verbs. Tip number 8. Descriptive language. Use as much as possible adjectives and ad To describe a picture can be asked in the Duolingo English test. It has two parts. Either describe by writing or speaking. I will share step-by-step -step techniques to perform well in the real exam. First tip. Be well prepared before you start speak or write. Second tip. Avoid fillers words. For example, uh, um, and so on when you speak. Try to avoid the most common word uses in your writing. Third tip. Do not label a picture. In the given picture, do not write like below. Many people are sitting together. In an office and talking something. It is called labeling. What you see, you write only that. You will have very low score. Fourth tip. Learn introductory statements. 1. This is a picture of. 2. This photo shows. 3. In this image there is, there are. 4. This is a stunning photograph of. 5. In this photo I can see. From there, quickly chose one introductory statement. For this, I have chosen number 3 statement. And my first complete sentence is. In this image, there are a lot of people doing their daily activities at the office. Fifth tip. What is where? In this provided image, my answer is. The spacious office is in the center of the beautiful city of Mumbai of India. Sixth tip. What is in the image and where is it positioned? In this provided image, my answer is. It is a commercial office located on the ground floor of this building. Seventh tip. Who is doing what? In this provided image, my answer is. All the people are processing the shipping documents effectively. Final and eighth tip. Use descriptive language. Try to use as much as possible adjectives and adverbs. In speaking, you need to speak with the adjectives and adverbs. 
but for writing you have a chance to add. For example, I have added the words as below. Sincerely. Spacious. Beautiful. Effectively. Now testing, we can speak in 60 second or not. The timer in the left side. Once start, the timer will be on. 3. 2. 1. In this image, there are a lot of people doing their daily activities sincerely at the office. The spacious office is in the center of the beautiful city of Mumbai of India. It is a wide commercial office located on the ground floor of this building. All the people are processing the shipping documents effectively. It takes only 30 to 35 seconds to speak four sentences. If you can, add one or two sentences more. Good. Now we can test for writing in 90 second or not. The timer in the left side. Once start, the timer will be on. 3, 2, 1. Important notes. You need to practice as much as possible. For speaking four to six sentences can speak. But for writing I could only four sentences. If you can write faster, you can add more sentences to get higher score. Hopefully this video will help you a lot. Please subscribe my channel.